himself you cannot silence the Iranian people and you cannot silence the rest of us we will continue to speak out against the terrible injustice that has been done uh, to Jafar Panahai and to all Iranians who are being silenced and threatened whose most basic rights are being denied the treatment of Jafar and Mohammed is outrageous we stand here today to demand, to demand the government of Iran overturn their sentences and curtail its abuses against thousands of other peaceful Iranian citizens. As someone who was in solitary confinement for 107 days, I can tell you that your voices are heard, even inside Iran, uh, Evin prison in Iran and other prisons around the country. Please think about thousands of unknown prisoners all around Iran who are suffering and and uh, no one knows what is going to happen. To them. There is no justice in Iran. Interrogators, they determine the sentences of prisoners and the judges are just agents of the interrogators for passing those sentences. I'm really pleased to be standing here with Paul Haggis and representing dozens of giant and giants in the film community to send a clear message to the Iranian government. Our calls for freedom will not stop. They will not fade. They will not be silenced. Not with the sentencing of one man, or the detention of hundreds, or the persecution of thousands. Our calls for freedom, in solidarity with the Iranian people, will continue until Iranians can live with their human rights intact, with security, and with freedom. Thank you. Trudy Stein. Their suffering strikes such a chord with artists because the right to think and speak freely is precious and at the core of who we are. Freedom of expression is our right, not only as artists, but as humans. These harsh sentences must be overturned and the suffering of Panahi and Rasulov must end. Now I'm going to we're going to ask uh, Paul uh, to, in honor of Jafar and Muhammad, uh, to make a declaration of the name of the place in which we're now standing. This is now Azadi Square. Thank you. And now, if there are any, we just have a. Azadi. Jafar was held in Evan prison, as there are more, including three juveniles who have been executed political prisoners, who, as I said, uh, worded offenses after unfair trials, many of whom are uh, the most amazing human beings I've ever met. Someone who is not only... We cannot, but we, we will forget. ...tests that took place two years ago, following a... 